Channel 3 reports. News on the hour. Shots from a high-powered rifle make for some major power problems in North Sacramento. We'll explain at 11. And out with the old to make room for the new, we'll show you this implosion from Houston at 11. Also, three years ago, the lives of some Denver residents were changed forever. Meet the man who was taken hostage during the real chase and find out what he has to say about that terrifying day. We'll see you right here at 11. Channel 3 reports. News on the hour. They call themselves grandparents for honesty and integrity, and they're fighting for their fired superintendent. Find out why. At least one California lawmaker wants water meters to be put in all new homes and businesses in the state. Would it really help our drought problems? And did the same person who made the threats also do the killing? We will tell you about a Michigan anchor woman murdered. We'll see you here tonight at 11. Tyson, Gretzky, and Kostner, just a few of the voices that care at 11. Defense Secretary Cheney says to prepare for the worst, a Mideast update at 11. Meet the real-life kidnap victim of the chase at 11. Some of this. A live report from Saudi Arabia tonight at 11. The company that owns wine stocks files for bankruptcy. More at 11. An anchor woman is shot to death in Michigan. Details tonight. Channel 3 reports. News at the half hour. You just discussed that someone would take the time to damage your property and at the same time, not just damage your property, but uh, want to deliver a message of hate and fear. Is the South Sacramento family the target in what looks like a vicious hate crime? Find out what local religious and community leaders have to say at 11. Also, the first Los Angeles female police officer to be killed in the line of duty. We'll tell you how it happened. And is it the end of the West Coast's largest department store chain? Find out. These stories plus a Mideast update and a live report from Saudi Arabia at 11. Channel 3 reports. News at the half hour. He said, get in that truck or you're dead. Right now. And boy, that scared the day out of me. Oh, my God. His life was changed forever three years ago. Find out what the real kidnap victim in the chase has to say at 11. Also, why would anyone want to set fire to a downtown electrical contracting company? Find out what police and employees are saying. Also, Hollywood celebrities turning out to raise their voices for the troops in the Gulf. Plus, the president's top military advisors are back on U.S. soil. A full Mideast update when Channel 3 reports at 11. February 1988, Denver, Colorado. They were ordinary people whose lives were about to be changed forever. Get up. When the most dangerous man in Denver history hit the street. They had him and they lost it. Together they rose to the challenge. Behind the media hype of this true story is an even more amazing one of heroism which only the participants can explain. Tonight at 11, the story as it actually took place. When Channel 3 reports here on KCRA TV Channel 3. The verdict is in for now at least. President Bush says the ground war is on hold. Israel suffers through another scud attack with both damage and injuries. And the high-tech people who make sure that our high-tech weapons of war actually work. We'll have a special report next on the news. The prognosis for actor Michael Landon. More coming up at 11. Meet the man they call the sweetheart swindler tonight on the news at 11. L.A. Police Chief Darrell Gates gets to keep his job. Late details at 11. A former mental patient goes on a killing rampage in Central California at 11. Women who kill for revenge. A special report at 11. He was locked in a room for 33 years. The story at 11. Register for CPR Saturday, February 1st. Channel 3 reports, news headlines. Pretty soon, there may not be money left for school activities like this. Coming up tonight, a live report as speak people speak out against some school budget cuts. Also tonight, a first ever cancer treatment being tried for Michael Landon. And why here, why now? We'll begin a special report on the violence that has gripped Northern California recently. Join us right after the Channel 3 reports, news headlines. Why here, why now? 
Northern California's murder rate is soaring, and so are other crimes. We'll begin a special report tonight looking at the reasons behind those frightening statistics. Also, at 11, the story of an elderly Stockton woman who fell into the wrong hands after a trip to the store. And he's known as a sweetheart swindler, but his victims say there's nothing sweet about him. We'll have details tonight at 11. See you then. Channel 3 reports. News on the hour. Lighting candles to show support for people living with AIDS. We'll show you what's happening in Northern California tonight and all over the world. Also, remembering a Northern California pilot killed in Honduras. Plus, two boys make a grisly discovery in the Sacramento River. Is it murder or just a terrible accident? Also, the story of a man locked in the same room for more than 30 years. That story at 11. Channel 3 reports. News at the half hour. A Citrus Heights man is in custody tonight. He's a suspect in his stepmother's murder. The story at 11. Also, a former mental patient goes on a killing rampage in Central California. Plus, hundreds of bikers roll into the Capitol without helmets. But is it too late? We'll have late information concerning the governor and the mandatory helmet law. And we'll show you some of the zaniest runners in Northern California. Join us at 11. Dates and details, a schedule of activities in Northern California. Help support the Sac State Hornets tennis team at this Tennis Alumni Booster Roundup. Learn about methods to control diabetes at this class on January 14th. Enjoy hiking and bird watching on this wildlife area field trip January 4th. And don't miss performances of the Dance Theater of Harlem January 21st through the 26th. This is KCRA TV, Channel 3, Sacramento, Stockton, and Modesto. At 430, 40, Stockton, 39, Modesto. See entertainment tonight. Thursday night at 11.35 on Channel 3. Born from incest on the next Maury Povich Show. Friday at 3, here on Channel 3. Our military objectives are met. I will have to retire from the Lakers. This year, KCRA, in partnership with the Child Abuse Prevention Council, Weinstocks, and the Sacramento Bee, all came together to help with the Care for Our Children campaign. Our goal was to raise funds and then collect gifts for needy children in Sacramento. And with your support, over 1,500 gifts and more than $20,000 has been collected for these children and their families. Thank you for helping to make this worthwhile campaign a huge success. And happy holidays to you and your families. From all of us. Channel 3 reports. News at the half hour. Are you fed up with Republicans, Democrats, and all the others? Well, as of today, you have a new choice in the form of California's newest political party. We'll tell you what it stands for when Channel 3 reports at 5. Also in the news, an experiment goes wrong at a Northern California research facility killing one person. And the new popularity of secondhand stores here in California. All of that coming up here on our news at 5 o'clock, right after Phil.